Oh, the Argent Tower. We're definitely going to get some nice tools here, ladies and gentlemen. I would say you probably get the most useful one. You get two of the most useful ones. Oh, that's right, yeah. There are thrust boots in the maintenance hangar. Yep, yep. Go get them boots, boy. Yeah, I definitely want those. Oh, it's the spooky skeleton! The Revenant himself, the Lord of the Doom memes. <laughs> Fucking... Have you seen the... I'm sure you have. Have you seen the meme where he's got the trumpets? Yeah, the, yeah, dude. That's a skin for Doom Eternal. <laughs> That's amazing, they, I didn't know that. Yeah, that, 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 that's that just made my day. Yeah, that's it's fucking awesome. I love it software. Okay, okay, oh, oh, okay. Oh, oh, oh. I'm not a fan of this though. No, fine. It's fucking rocket launcher you guys to death. I'm shooting his energy balls at you. Oof. Wow, he really put his foot in his mouth on that one. Ugh, kill yourself. There you are. Get them boots. Okay, double jump. God, that's going to make my life so much easier. It's got to be tough, like, going from not having double jump to playing through those four, first four levels without it. Yeah, you, you significantly change your playstyle once you get the double jump. Yeah, it's amazing how much it actually changes things. It gives you so much more flexibility than you would normally have. All right, we got another rune up here. Oh yeah, you do. We'll grab the armor. And I like how that armor is just a big plate of metal. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that the Slayer, if he had a choice, he'd probably just start duct taping like fucking tank turrets to himself. Well, yeah, that'll do. <laughs> I think you said it best when we were playing uh, uh, Remnant, uh, where uh, the, wearing that heavy armor was just like wearing a car door. Yeah, exactly. Basically, every Gears of War character. Really? Now, it would be kind of dumb if it did count, but imagine if you could get your uh, mastery here. Oh, yeah, I wish it counted. It would make it really easy to get it. You'd be surprised how many times I've actually failed this one. I, no, I believe you. It's not easy because they're kind of scattered. Yeah, you got to move very fast. I could have gotten a double on that. Oh, there you go. It, it was kind to you. Yep. Let you know where they're at yeah, when you get almost easy. done. Yeah, I think it's Imagine the last it didn't. three. Uh, well, I mean, if as long as you're just going in a circle and you're moving quick, you'll be fine anyways. Yeah, so you, you say moving quick, so just moving forward as the Doom Slayer, because he's fucking yeah. quick as shit. Where's my sprint button? It's like, there isn't one. You press forward and you sprint. Doom guy only has two speeds. Yes and no. Yeah. <laughs> that is a bit... Very... Well. Good job. See, now I forgot that I had the double jump. And it hit the fucking back of his head. Okay. Thanks, Slayer. There we go. <laughs> You just jumped oh, up for the second and just hit your face on there. What are you are you doing on purpose? <laughs> yes. So you said those little armor pickups only count as one on Ultra Nightmare? A nightmare and Ultra Nightmare. The only difference between Nightmare Fuck. and Ultra Nightmare is that if you die on Ultra Nightmare, then it's game over. It's literally the only difference. That's why I'm annoyed that I've died like what four times now on ultra violence because i'm like i should not be dying on this because i usually play well, a nightmare one of them is it was instant death because you jumped to your death and the other one you were doing on purpose so yeah but you can't two, really count those two of them were legitimate deaths though oh yeah you got your ass kicked okay so what do we have here chiropractor perform four neck or jawbreaker glory kills on imps find three secrets easy enough and kill 15 demons using quad damage oh god how will i ever cope with that I'm coming for you. I thought there was only one quad damage in this chapter or in this mission. So when I didn't get it, I was like, oh fuck. No, there's three I of guess them. I'll just reset the checkpoint. Yeah, there's three <laughs> of them. 
So, I, and then I found the next one, I was like, oh. Well, that was a waste of time. This is a good point to farm the super shotgun. Yeah, there you go. God damn, that thing has such ridiculous range. Oh, yeah. In terms of, like, how far you... Well, these guys are weak, too, anyway, but still. It just makes it feel even more powerful. Shit. Need to get rid of him. There we go. I'll take the damage. I don't care. Have you ever been tickled on the inside? Stop touching me, Elmo. When you press his back, Elmo puts his hand on your knee and says fun things. Have you ever been tickled on the inside? Ah, oh, damn, I fucked oh, up. I was about to say, you don't have to do four of them, and there's plenty of imps in this level. Yeah, there's plenty of them. Yeah, hell not, you're not surviving that. Oh, no, you're oh, still no. alive, okay. <laughs> He seems a little confused. Oh. Oh yeah. This is also where my favorite, uh, pretty much everybody's favorite track uh, from Mick Gordon's soundtrack comes into. This is the level where you first get introduced to the glorious BFG division. Hands down the best track in the entire game. Oh, yeah. Okay, don't really need this, but actually, I do like to have the tactical scope for literally one part of this level. Hmm. I wasn't, big, I wasn't really a huge fan of tactical scope because it made you slow down your gameplay too much. Yeah. To use it effectively. Well, plus it puts you in tunnel vision, and that's a bad thing with Doom. They changed, oh, yeah. they changed how the scope works in Doom Eternal, though. Now it's one very high-powered shot, so it's good for, like, an instant headshot on an enemy or for uh, taking out weak points. Gotcha. Actually, you know what? Fuck these guys. I don't even need to deal with them. I'm out of here. Bye! Oh! Okay, he's like, get back here. You need to stop that. Got a secret down here. Another predator token. Grab that. Grab that USB. Don't don't wait to safely remove that USB. Just yank it out. <laughs> Ain't nobody got time to wait to safely remove. There we go. Power up. Effectiveness is maxed out. Oh, wow. That was quick. Yep. This is what I was trying to tell you earlier about, like, if you play your cards right in the first half, the second half, you can literally just rip through it. Yeah. Uh-oh, there she is. There's Claire Redfield. I mean, Olivia. Uh, that's an argent accumulator she's carrying. She'll try to use it to open a portal manually into hell. While the argent tower is non-functional, the connection to their dimension is still viable. We are at great risk, Dr. Hager. Why is she covered in blood? Why would she not be covered in blood? Is she just bathing in it? It's doom. Everything's covered in blood. Oh, these fucking summoners. Okay, so... Actually, the summoners are a more advanced version of the imp. If you go through and you yeah. read all the logs. Yep, I remember that, actually. And welcome to the UAC. Home of the patented Argent Energy Filtration System developed by Dr. Olivia Pierce. We are the only corporation with this technology, able to convert pure hell energy into clean, controllable Argent energy. It powers this facility and is broadcast throughout the universe from Argent Tower, providing all the energy a family needs to live a fun and productive life on Earth and the surrounding <laughs> economies. But we can't do it Imagine describing energy harnessed from an alternate to hell dimension as clean. Yeah, exactly. Three, four, there you go. Done. Wow, that 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 extra uh, duration for their um, stun animation really helped you out there. Yep. Oh, there it is. Oh there yeah, is. quad damage, oh, baby. Jesus. I think my first experience with quad damage was actually in the multiplayer, and it was just it was brutal. You want to know what my first experience with quad damage is? What? Quake. Oh yeah, it is in Quake too. Yep, that's where it came from. And you're already done. Well, wow. <laughs> there you are. Well, he's dead now. Okay, we've got one secret coming up here, as well as a Praetor token. Oh, I, I remember log. this. 
I remember the secret. This it's secret, not fun to get to. Yeah, this one's not too bad. There's another one in this. There's actually two in this that are a real pain in the ass because this is really the one that uh, introduces a lot of platforming. So you got to be very precise with a lot of your jumps, which I kind of yes. like that because they gave you your your double jump right in the exact same level where they really wanted to emphasize the platforming. Yeah, so they want you to learn how to use it. Mm -hmm. It's almost it's almost like id software is a group of people that are incredibly talented and actually know what the fuck they're doing or something like that. Oh yeah, imagine that. Yeah, weird. <laughs> I mean, it's software's been making games for over 30 years, so they better know what they're doing at this point. Yeah. I mean, they create... Those will kill you, right? If you run into them? What? Those. The rotating oh. things. These things? Yeah. Yeah, they'll kill... Well, not if you run into them, but they'll squish you. I gotta say, there are definitely parts of this level I don't like, though, because there's a lot of waiting around, waiting for things to just get out of your way. Yes. I'm not a fan of that in any game, especially in something like Doom that's moving fast, and it just feels like it slows me down. Mm-hmm. Actually, I think one of your favorite levels is right after this one. Yep. You already know which one it is, don't you? Mm-hmm. Because oh. the moment leading up to getting to that level is fucking bonkers. Yeah. Oh, yeah. This, this room right here is when I fell in love with Doom 2016, right here. There's the make of uh -oh. this. There's the shit demon. He's the poo-poo demon. They eat the poo-poo. And we're off! Thank you, this is a fucking brutal. Yeah, they're really tough. I see you, Hell Knight. Yeah, there's the music. Hello! <laughs> Bring it on! Pop his ass. Oh, well. Oh, aren't you adorable? Woo, yeah, baby. Gotta love that BFG division. That is definitely what I think of when I think of Doom music. Yeah, exactly. Mick Gordon did an amazing job with the soundtrack. Oh. So have you, ever actually, have you died in this room before trying to navigate it? Oh, yeah. Oh, God, yeah. When I first played it, oh, yeah. I died plenty of times here. This is the uh, level where I learned, oh, there is fall damage in this game. Yeah. <laughs> well, there, here's the thing. There's there there is not fall damage. There's you land perfectly fine or you die. Yeah, there's yeah, you, no you're damage. Totally right. It's one or the other. Yes, it's a it's a it's a logic check. Yes or no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there you go. So now we out. actually need to bring the scope out. You gonna shoot some dudes? Nope. I need to see something. That's a noise that will fucking uh, grate on you. Yeah, if you're in here for too long. Yeah. Okay, so here's what I want my scope for. Okay. Nope. Oh, other side. yeah. Do you know what I'm doing? Yeah, there's a secret trying to get. Yep. Not a secret collectible, right? Yep. Well, they, it counts as a secret, but yeah, it is a collectible. It's a Doom guy, right? Yep, there he is. Yep, purple guy. Yeah, this is how, and this is when I discovered, uh, was falling everything, because I missed that jump and died. Yep. I don't even, uh, actually jump. I just wait until I'm in the air, and then just use the, uh, secondary jump when I yeah. get moved. Because he gives you a finer degree of control. Yep. Oh, we're about to walk into a fucking bloodbath. This room has actually killed me quite a few times. I believe it.
Uh oh. Well, that's awkward. <laughs> it, it's a do. You know, like, every time we worried about that stuff, which was totally fucking valid. Mm. You look at the sprites going, Burr, and like the, the stuff, you know what I mean? And, and you're just like, <laughs> we could do anything. You know, like, yeah. like have you seen the stuff that goes on to do? <laughs> All right, there we go. Hey, figure it out. Oh, I, yep. Yeah, I remember this room. Yep, this one can be rough. He's having a bad day. What's the matter, Revenant? Am I too smooth for you? <laughs> well, well. Oh, what, look at what? that. Huh. That's uh, unusual. <laughs> Bring it on. Oh, aren't you adorable? You know I'm not afraid of you, right? <laughs> it's like the idea of Doom Guy finding power ups and just like, oh, well, I turned on my god mode. Yeah. Come here. There you go. I'd like to talk to both of you. Oh, well. <laughs> Uh-oh. Lord. A wise man once said, Damn, I'm good. The road to hell is paved by Argent Energy. Ah, look what we have here. Yeah, grab that. Grab it and squeeze it. All right, well, we might as well go ahead and max out the ammo so we don't have to worry about it anymore. There you go. Bam. Because that gives you, what, seven chainsaw charges? Yep. Seven chainsaw charges. We'll have three BFG shots when we get it, and a total of 60 shotgun shells. I can deal with that. All right, so we have a pain there in the ass secret here to get. I think I vaguely... Oh, yeah, I remember it now. I remember it. it's not fun to get. <laughs> Well, let's see. Let's uh, let's go ahead and max out the recovery time and the lock-on burst for the uh, rocket launcher. Because I do like my rocket launcher. What's the uh, upgrade do for the lock-on? I don't remember. I'll talk my head. Um, you can split the shots, so you could lock on to three different targets. I actually don't like it, so I never go for it. Because if I'm... Okay. I actually want to aim at one enemy with it, and only one. I don't want to split those rockets. Yeah. I mean, it sounds like it could be useful if the rockets did more damage individually. But yeah. They, they kind of don't do that much damage by themselves. Yeah. I mean, it's not a bad upgrade, but the the reason I use the rocket launcher is because I'm trying to take out one tough enemy, not because I want to split yeah, the shot. Yeah, exactly. And pull this lever. There you go. Then we got to go yeah. all the way back down. And this is, this is definitely one of the things I don't like about this level. I don't mind the platforming stuff because the platforming is well implemented. I just don't like waiting around to actually be able to yeah. do stuff. I agree. I'm hoping that Especially they fix in, that in Doom Eternal. Doom. Yeah, I'm really hoping they fix that in Doom Eternal. I know they've added a lot of platforming sections in Doom Eternal, but from what I've seen, they seem like they move quite a bit quicker and they don't really waste your time as much. Yes, I agree. From what I've seen, at least. Doom Eternal, it, so far it looks like it's going to blow this one out of the water, which, that's impressive. Here's hoping. Yeah. I mean, because... It's not exactly a, an easy task to, to complete, uh, to no. do this. Like, because before Doom Eternal was even announced, I kept thinking to myself, I'm like, how are you going to outdo Doom 2016? This game is so damn good. Like, how are you going to do better than this? And they managed to do it, because it looks really damn good. Oh, can I make it? Oh, come on! Yes! Ah, uh, there you go. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Oh. Okay. I was okay. gonna say, you definitely want to, don't want to be there. <laughs> yeah, we're good. We're good. I think that was a... That was some kind of weird bug. Bug! Alright, so, instead of waiting for this thing to stop moving, 
I'm the Doom Slayer. I can take it. <laughs> I would have laughed so hard if you just instantly died. No, I've done that multiple times. That's usually okay. how I get up here. Now we'll go ahead and pull the scope out. Because there's going to be a, some asshole imps out here that I want to Oh, yeah, I remember off. guys. God, no, I, I can't do it. I cannot do that. It just bugs me. Bug! Playing Doom with a fucking scope. It just slows down the combat too much. Yeah, in my it does. opinion. And it just feels it just feels wrong in this game. Like the only reason the Doom guys can use a sniper rifle is he's gonna beat you to death with it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the rockets will do the trick. Come on. And did you know that's an uh, it's an energy booster if you step in there? Gives you more health. Liar! Liar! I think you're lying to me. Am I though? Liar. Here's the thing, you doubted me, for, you doubted yourself for a minute, he's like, wait, does he know something I don't know? No, because I've walked into it and it's killed me before, I fucking know better oh. than that. <laughs> okay, now we can go ahead and farm these demons in here. Well, okay, okay, well, they're slapping you. Take those guys out first, then we can farm these guys, boost the shotgun a little bit more. There you go. You're almost halfway there. Yep. Oh, okay. oh hello. hi, buddy. Just he uh, he had a mission and a purpose. And he failed at it. Well, a little patience goes a long way. Now we got a rune out here we can grab. And actually, Ken, I'm about to show you something that I guarantee you did not find. Okay. After we get through this. Equipment power. This is actually a very good rune, depending on if you know how to use it correctly. Okay. What do you mean by that? Well, it doubles the duration of your holograms. And with your siphon grenades, if you're full on health, it actually will recharge your armor. So it can actually be very, okay. very useful if you uh, are playing on uh, Nightmare or Ultra Nightmare, in particular Ultra Nightmare. Yeah, that, I, yeah, I, I just never thought about it that way, to be honest, because mm -hmm. I, I don't think I really use the siphon grenades that much. Most people didn't, and it's understandable why. I might not get this, actually, because we're really slow to get over here. Well, you might be all right. Uh-oh, yeah. Oh, got that button. And it likes to live dangerously. Another rune unlocked. What is that, three now? Uh, one, two, three. Uh, yeah, I think it's three. Yeah, that'll unlock our second slot, so we can actually put that on. No, that's four. That's four? Okay. Yeah, ammo that's because we got ammo boost. Yeah, I forgot we got ammo boost, so we'll go ahead and throw on equipment power. I think that's what I did when I was uh, doing this. Just toss uh, them. Trying to... Yeah, we just tossed them because they didn't really do anything anyway. Yep. Okay, here's the thing I guarantee you didn't know about. Okay. No, I found it the first time because I remember seeing a blue light glowing. I was Bullshit. Like, oh. I don't believe you. Bullshit. Okay, well then. There's our Praetor token. We should be good on everything here. Just double check. Missing one secret. Hmm. Wait, what secret what am I is? missing? Oh, Oh, I know what it is. Well, let's go ahead and... You know, I'm going to go for uh, self-preservation, decrease self-weapon damage. I would normally go for the equipment system, but I'm not going to really use it much on this run. Yeah. Because you can get, what, two more charges? Yes, and they, uh, I can, uh, you can get two charges and you can get them to recharge faster. Last secret. Right here. Oof. Hello, my friend. There you go. Now you have a use for all that plasma oh, energy you have. Oh, <laughs> yes, baby. Yes. So now we can do the rocket launcher Goss Cannon combo. Yep. Rest in peace, everything. We're only missing two weapons. Yeah, that's right. Yep. 
and we'll get the next one in a secret in the next level. And we'll also get two Easter eggs in the next level as well. And we'll also get to play Ken's favorite level. Well, is it your yes. favorite level or is it one of your favorites? Oh, absolutely. It's my favorite level. Really? Okay. Oh, yeah. Shit's about to hit the fan, and I love Welcome it. To the UAC. Opening the gates of hell with the key to the future. <laughs> <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? Thank you. 